Hello everybody, welcome back. Nintendo Lumpy here, and welcome to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. In the last episode, we did a lot of skull searching, heart piece searching, and some... Okay, the one thing I will admit I'm an idiot for in the last episode is trying to get double defense, which if you remember me trying to lift that big old thing in Ganon's castle, or at least outside of Ganon's castle, yeah, that technically I'm not supposed to get yet. Apparently, I'm supposed to get that once I get an item later on. So I'm so sorry about that. I, maybe I edited it out. Maybe I left it in for a little bit. But hey, that was just me being an idiot wasting time. But in this episode, we're going to continue our journey of trying to complete all these little side quests before we get to anything crazy. And a part of that is seeing what's under this rock. Because I think... Okay, no. I was trying to... There we go. I think there's something under this rock. And hey, I was correct. I, I was just kind of guessing. I saw the rock... Oh, it's a fairy fountain. Honestly, it's kind of good that I'm here because you know what I'm going to do, actually, because you never know what could possibly happen. So let's honestly get some fairies so we can just kind of be prepared for ahead of time because you never know what could fucking happen. You honestly don't know. Also, by the way, one thing I should mention right now, for once, I'm not actually live on Twitch. For once, I'm actually recording offline. Now, you're probably wondering, wait a minute, why are you recording offline? Why aren't you live or whatever? It's because I'm really motivated right now to record this game. Why? It's because I'm literally so close to finishing it. Like, I'm not even kidding. Literally, if I can just keep on grinding, like, episodes. Like, for example, my last video that I uploaded as of right now is the I hate, well, not, not I hate you. It's the Mario Creepypasta video I made. Now, right now, I'm going to... Oh, you scared the bejesus out of me. No, is it right here? Because there's supposed to be like a little secret area where I'm supposed to... Okay, you're going to be an issue, and I don't appreciate you, and you're kind of annoying. Unless, wait a minute, is it over here? I think it's... Isn't it by this tree or something? Because there's something over here that I'm supposed to get, but I don't know where... Oh my god, I actually found it. I literally, I was going to keep on stalling until I found it, and I actually found it. I'm proud of myself. But yes, we're going to be in here... Now, I don't know why the Zelda team was like, okay, let's add random holes in the game. Well, obviously to kind of fill some space in or whatever. But right here, we are going to get another piece of heart. I I don't know. That's honestly kind of clever if you think about it. Hiding a piece of heart there. Also, how many pieces do I have left? All right. One more. All we need is one more. And as soon as we get the one more one, we have all hearts. And that's... Dude, that's kind of crazy to me. It's like, I remember starting this game back in 2019. No, when I started my original, like, uh, on my own playthrough of this back in 2018 on Wii Virtual Console, I never really imagined getting full heart containers, and here I am, literally five years later, doing the exact same thing, but this time on original hardware. I'm not even playing on, even on an original cartridge, like one... Okay, let's try to get my thoughts together better. Playing on a 1.0 cartridge and playing it on N64 and finally beating 100% like that, that's even crazier to me. Now, another thing I do want to point out really quickly, I do have some notes on the side that I like to kind of keep track of where I want to go each episode. I noticed I have one skull that I have to get left, but I also kind of noticed I have literally not even... I have like six left. I think that's the correct math. But I noticed on my map here, because I noticed this thanks to ZFG, or I think it was some other YouTuber. I'm just going to say ZFG for now. You notice next to Haunted Wasteland, there's nothing there. But if I were to go to Gruta's Fortress, there's a skull icon next to it. But then if I go over to, like, for example, Walnut Ranch, there's no skull icon there. It's Some areas have icons, but then some don't. So I'm assuming when I was in... When I was playing through some of those areas, I just never got the skulls, or maybe it just kind of went past me or something. So I think what I'm going to try to do now before I do other stuff is figure out where these other gold skulls are and where this final last heart piece is so we can finally have full heart containers or a full a full set of hearts or whatever I'm trying to say. <gasps> I got it! No way. Okay, this... Okay, I don't know if this will be the last one, but, dude, look... I can't believe I got it with the Goron Sword. Because, honestly, I've never really decided to try it with a Goron Sword. Because, again, I never played this game a lot when I kind of finished it afterwards, if that makes sense. Like, back when I played on Wii Virtual Console, I beat it. I was happy. I was like, all right, I want to move on to a different game. I want to play Majora's Mask. And I did move on to Majora's Mask eventually. But then I was like, okay, I have to kind of finish my Ocarina of Time Let's Play. I started first, so I should probably do that. Also, while I'm here, I'm here to do one other thing, but I think another thing I should try to do, even though I probably already did this, and if I already did this, a future editor will probably cut away to the actual thing I'm supposed to be doing. 
All right, so the next thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be destroying these rocks here. I think it's not this one right here. We're going to destroy... We're going to just... We're going to... Hello? Is it a bomb that I have to use on you? Or something? Okay, it's an indestructible rock. That's kind of... <gasps> Wait a minute. Unless... Can I grab it? No. <gasps> I can! Wait a minute. And then I throw... Oh, okay. Okay, that... Okay, there... You... Get down there, you stupid... Okay. Dude, I'm an idiot. Just get down. Drop. Thank you. We found a secret passage. Now, you're probably wondering, what does a secret passage lead to? What well, actually leads to nothing. It's just an empty floor area that the developers decided to add in here because they thought it was funny. They had a bunch of spiders in here because, hey, lol, funny, whatever other... Ugh, I don't even know what I'm trying to say. I, honestly... I never, I don't really remember this area, if I'm going to be honest, from when I originally paid, played back either on Wii Virtual Console or on, um, yeah, Wii Virtual Console and 3DS. I don't, did I even get this far in 3DS? I don't even remember. Okay, you're being annoying. I don't want to deal with you. Up here, we are going to find something. There's supposed to be something up here. I, I mean, I know what I think I have to do. Uh, where are you? And I'm so sorry. There you are. Do I have to make it nighttime? Wait, if I do this, will it force me back to the beginning of the area? I really hope it doesn't, because that would be kind of annoying. <sighs> Actually, that's fine. I can literally just redo this. All right, pick you up again. I think, because over in this area here, we're going to be getting at another gold skull slot. I just don't remember where it is, if I'm going to be honest. I think it's either... Oh, good one, buddy. You're so funny, dude. Come in. Yeah, I'm not going to mess with you. I'll leave you guys alone. I'm just going to go... Stop. How? I'm not even near you guys. I'm just trying to go over here, man. I'm trying to have fun. Well, actually, not really. I'm just trying to delve in the deep secrets of... The Don not the Dongo's Cavern of Zora's Domain? Zora's River? What? Where am I? I don't remember. I don't really remember. Is this Super Mario 64? <laughs> oh yeah, speaking of Super Mario 64, by the way. So recently I found a gold skull tool that was hanging on the wall and I thought it was really cool. And I decided, you know what? I'm gonna waste my arrows on it instead of using the hook shot because I'm such a smart guy. And then I'm gonna finally take out my hook shot and then I'm gonna use it finally because I can't really do any bomb hovering to actually get the gold skull up there. So I decided to actually use my brain a little bit and then also jump in the water. But back to the thing I was trying to talk about. So, Super Mario 64 is a game that I used to play a lot. Now I don't anymore because I'm so busy with college work and, yeah, college work and then wage slaving. It's just so much all at once. I don't have time to speed run that game as much. But recently, there was a huge discovery, at least in 120 Star, where you can no longer use the carpet. Now you're probably wondering, wait, carpets? What about carpets? Pretty much there's a trick called Carpetless where you can, in the Bowser in the, not Bowser in the Sky, in Rainbow Ride there's this one mission where you can skip the carpet all. Where you have to ride the carpet to get a star, but with Carpetless you can skip that all together and you can actually save so much time. And recently there's been so many world records with it, it's honestly crazy. Right now Mario 64 is in a golden age and I'm glad to be a part of it. I'm glad to watch all like the speedrunners play and everything. And I... Maybe one day I'll learn it. Maybe during my future Let's Play of Mario 64, I'll try to do Carpetless. Now, we got that Gold Skull here, and now, here's the other thing. I don't really know what else I'm going to do. I clearly have one heart piece left. We have five skulls left. I think I'm missing some skulls. Apparently, in Lon Lon Ranch, I'm missing some, so I think I'm going to head over there next, and I'm going to see what potentially Gold Skull Tullas I'm missing, even though I'm pretty sure I've gotten all of them over there. Okay, so I decided to come back here as a kid instead because I'm assuming as an adult you really don't get any skulls here. But as you can tell, yeah, I'm gonna throw my boomerang just randomly. Well, not randomly. I already got the one here. I don't know if I got the one that's on the side. Or did I already get this one? I'm pretty sure I got this one already. Are you serious? Are you actually serious? Are you actually serious? I swear to God, I got this one already. Okay, now am I complete here at Lon Lon? Wait. Now I am. I got all of them here. But wait, I, I swear, in like 2019, I got that already. That is... A hey, I'm not going to question it. I thought... Maybe I forgot the one over there on the silo, but I guess I didn't. 
All right, so that marks all of the gold skulls for Lon Lon. All we have left now is apparently Haunted Wasteland. Um, where else? Lost Woods, and then so Lost Woods. What did I miss in Lost Woods? I don't fully. I really don't remember. I guess is it an adult or child? I'm not. I, I guess I'll meet you guys back there when I get to Lost Woods at some point. Okay, we're back in the Lost Woods once again. Now, I'm pretty sure I think the Gold Skull Tail that we're missing, if I had to guess. Because I think I remember one episode struggling to try to figure out where this... I tried coming back to this one and it didn't. nothing came out. I think if I'm possibly correct, there's a dirt patch over here... And I think once I deal with this bozo right here, who's going to be really annoying, I think it's possibly... Is it over here or is it not you? Or is it over here? I swear it's somewhere around in this area. For some reason in my brain, I don't remember doing this. Follow along with our song under your ocarina. We'll lead you into it. Down, left, up. Down, left, right, up. Okay, this has to be the last thing, right? Okay, never mind. I'm just talking out of my ass. Alright, I'm gonna have to cheat here. So if my gameplay freezes for a second, you'll know why. Alright, so it's... Okay, so you're probably wondering, what did I do? Pretty much what I did was, I did snipping tool. <laughs> Please take this. Alright, is it a hard piece? No, it's not. Do you want to play some more? Okay. I don't know. I don't remember. I Here's the thing. I don't fucking remember what heart piece I did not get or what did I get. I don't remember. It hurts my head and I don't want to keep doing pointless shit to like ruin the episode timeline. That's what I'm worried about. Maybe I was right. Maybe I have to do more of that, but I'm not fully sure. Okay, so the next Gold Skulltula, I believe, should be... Oh my god. I was right. Okay, so I'm gonna be honest, I went back as a child. When I, when I was a child, I went back here because I thought maybe I missed it in some other places, but nope. Right there. It was right there. The in I knew- that was the- okay, that's why I put in the bean, bro. I'm so stupid, man. Okay, what's left? All that's left, I think, now. Because Zora's Domain's done. Kokiri Forest is done. Lost Woods is done. Kokiri Kakiriko Village is done. Uh, Death Mountain is done. Hyrule Field's done. Lon Lon's done. Lake Hylia is done. Gruta Valley, Gruta Fortress. It's now Haunted Wasteland. How many do I have right now? 90, 97. So I'm missing... How many am I missing in Haunted Wasteland to where it's going to amount to 100? That I'm not fully sure so i guess i'll mute you guys back when i get to haunted wasteland okay i am once again a kid now here's the thing this could be edited out i'm not fully sure yet but i'm assuming this is the one i missed here if it isn't then i really don't know because i got the one on the tree no fucking way give me one of you bug bastards back now there's no way Holy, and let me guess, this is the last one that I need to get, right? There's the blah, 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 blah. Okay, let's look at this. Is that all of them in? Okay, haunt. so there, that's done. This is done. Lake Hylia's done. Lon Lon's done. Market's done. Hyrule Field's done. Death Mountain's done. I've gone everything. So what's, le what's the two ones that I'm missing then? Because I don't know what those two could possibly be. Unless it's, wait, Death Mountain, I got in them. Market, I've gotten them. Lon Lon Ranch, I've gotten them. Lake Hylia, I've gotten them. Gruta Valley, I've gotten them. Unless it's two Gerado, Gerados. Gerados. Gerard. What is it fucking called? Grottos that I haven't gotten yet, then I really... Maybe I'll have to look up the Grottos that I haven't gone, possibly. Because I know I already got some of them. But that... That one makes sense. That one right there makes sense. I'll try to... Unless... Hmm. Yeah, I'll... I'll come back, guys, once I figure out the one grotto that I did not check for the... Or two grottos I haven't checked yet. Okay, so we're back in a familiar area that we haven't been to in a while. But also, in an area where if we listen closely... Actually, I don't feel like doing the whole editing bit of listening closely to the original music. They're in this bit, if you hear in the background, you hear in the background. So, in this temple, if you realize... 
there's no Skotala thing next to the Fire Temple. Because apparently once you complete a temple, you need to have... If you got all skulls in it, there's an icon next to the... Or there's like a skull icon next to the temple that's similar to the count to the icon right here. So I'm going to attempt to find the Skotala in here. And if I find it, I will cut back to you guys and show off how much an, of an idiot I was back in the day to not find the, the one from originally many moons ago. Okay, I've been running around this temple for like a hot second. There's one area I don't remember checking. No, that's the wrong song. No, how is Epona gonna help me in here? Dude, come on, man. I don't care. I'm sorry, Epona, I just don't care now. I want this song. I want the song of the... What's her name from Romani Ranch? That's what it's called. All right, we're playing Song of Feeling. We are done, and it's forever. Yeah. Okay. This might be the one that decides everything. I could be correct, and I could be wrong. I'm not fully sure. Let's see. Am I going to be saved from this temple and hearing all the chants and everything? Let's take a look now. Hopefully, um, uh, no leg, you, ah, oh, man, dude, come on, wait a minute, if it's just this door, am I fine, I'm fine, dude, all right, let's try, let's, for fuck's sake, dude, okay, let's try this again, please, okay, take two, don't hit any buttons on my controller, I'm not touching it, I'm letting Link go up here, and this should hopefully, Lead me to what I think it is. Lead me to possibly a Skoltala that I was... No way. No fucking way. Actually? I hear it. I hear it. Wait a minute. No way! This was the one I missed. Are you fucking serious? <laughs> oh my god. Okay, if I get it, is this the last one here? Okay, okay, okay. Officially... 99 that's officially 99 now hold on okay is this all for fire temple no the last one's in here but then wait a minute where would that last one be at then if that was not the okay dude how did i miss so much in fire temple like actually that surprises me i guess whatever note whatever walkthrough i used to help like no actual way I swear I got this one. I swear I got this one. Wait. Dude, I thought I fucking got that one. Bro, are you serious? Well, guys. Even though I guess I'm being schizophrenic and I forget everything. But boys, we now officially have a hundred gold Skotalas officially right here. All a hundred in this game. Now... I could be a, I know, I'm going to be honest, I've been recording for like 30, like almost 30 minutes, and I've done a lot of like pausing so I could figure a lot of things out, so I really don't know the official length of this episode, so what I might do is we're going to go teleport back to Kakariko right now to get our prize that we worked so hard for. Let's see if I remember um Shadow Song, wasn't it? I don't remember what it is. Let me look it up real quick. All right. The moment of truth and the moment of what we've been waiting for so hard. Finally getting our last reward for collecting all the skull flaws. Dude, I did not know I missed that much in Fire Temple. If I had to guess, I'm pretty sure I maybe had a crash in Fire Temple and maybe the skull flaws didn't save or something. But I swear I got the one on the wall after I got the hammer. But I guess the game either did not save nor... Maybe, I don't really remember, but who cares? We finally have 100 of them. I saved already. Let's talk to the big boss man right here. Since you've destroyed 100 spiders of this curse, the curse on me has been broken. Thank you. Here is a token of my appreciation. Please take it. All right, I hope it's better be the last heart piece because I really need a heart piece. I don't, I'm going to keep it a buck. I don't really know where the last heart piece is, actually, because I don't really know where else to check. But let's see. We have... Now, I would do the bit that Nintendo Capri Sun did back in his Let's Play of screaming like a crazy person. But currently, right now, it's 12 a.m. And I don't want to wake people up. So, I'm going to be the bigger man. 
and end this episode off here. If you guys enjoyed this episode of The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time, where you watched me run around the entire landscape of Hyrule to find literally two gold Skulltulas that were in Fire Temple this entire time, hit the like button. <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.